in the area at the time of Christ with nothing, none of these buildings around. It was just a huge garden. And you know, at the foothill of the garden, there is a, an oppress, an oil press. The oil press is inside there. That is what the Gospel of St. John, chapter 18, refers to. After the Last Supper, they crossed the Kidron Valley, which we are on, and they came to the press. So the Lord Jesus kept three, eight of them there, took with him three of the disciples, three of the apostles, Peter, James, and John, at a certain location, at the throw of a stone, drew with them, and he came to face, to face the Eastern Gate. So twice he came and checked on the apostles, and he says, remain here and pray, so you won't fall into temptation. But the third time, he got everybody and came to the, to the grotto because he knew it's coming. So at the entrance of the olive press, this is where all these question and answer happened between the G Jesus and the temple guards. And right at the entrance of it, you know, uh, the uh, Judas came and betrayed him with a kiss. It happened right here. So that's why when we kiss in this country, we men, we salute each other, we kiss. This is our tradition. It's not like we are from San Francisco. We're not gay. But we don't kiss once. It has to be three or four, but not once. Once it means a betrayal kiss. You know all that. Even Muslims does it as well, that's our tradition. <coughs> so he betrayed him with a kiss right here. Sam Peter all of a sudden took his sword and cut off the, uh, one of the ears of the guards. But this, the Lord Jesus brought, brought, brought it back up at that moment in his human nature, in his agony, when he was sweating and dripping blood on the rock, he performed a miracle. But also keep in mind, the Lord could have walked just half a mile up the hill and he's home free. He wanted that to happen so he can bring salvation to them and to us and to the whole world. So at this point, we can say the grotto, if there is any authentic thing in the country, like you say, River Jordan or Mediterranean or Dead Sea, that is authentic. Uh, That's the grotto. Oh, Simon, Simon says? What Simon says? Have good time, dear. Bonjour, Simon. Comment ça va? Bien, merci. Oui, oui. So this is where, uh, by the way, I did my first group back in 1980 in February with this guy. He used to, he was to, about to be a priest, but then he, he got married and he's Catholic. Yeah. So anyways, so the, uh, the grotto is something to look for. It's called the grotto of betrayal and it's connecting us to the passion of our Lord Jesus. And later we go inside, inside the basilica to celebrate. But what we are standing in front of what? We're standing in front of a building that it is almost the same age of the church of Santa. It was built on the remnants of a Byzantine church. It had two stories. The first, the upper level was removed and they fixed the mountain, the mosque, walls. But they kept the lower part, taking down all the frescoes and all the decorations. And there is 44 steps from the point of enter all the way down. On the right hand side is the tomb of the Blessed Mother. We don't like to say again, I repeat, we don't say the tomb of the Blessed Mother. It's an Islamic term for it, as the tomb of Mary. Okay, it's the first assumption, uh, assumption place from the fourth century. Now, as a local church Christians, we do have at the Feast of Assumption for the Catholic in August 15. And in August 25 is the Greek Orthodox. We join them on the 25. And we, we come here with Muslim ladies as well. We come down here and we venerate and we light the 44 steps with candles. Why 44 steps? Because it's the age of the Blessed Mother. Mm -hmm. 44 steps. On the way down, halfway down, there is an altar. That would be the tomb of Queen Melisanda, the one that during her reign as a king, as a queen, she finished the Holy Sepulchre Church, completed the Holy Sepulchre Church. She's the one who built the church in Bethany, the church here, and the church of Saint Anne. Before they start their mass and they require silence, I want you to go and see the grotto, and then come back and see this church, okay? Right.